Somewhere off an unfriendly shore, a huge American submarine lurks just beneath the surface. Navy SEALs, their mission behind enemy lines completed, swim aboard so the sub, the newly relaunched USS Georgia, can return them to safety. Dive! Dive! On the other side of the globe, a hard hat diver carefully combs the remains of another ship named Georgia. This one, the first ever to carry the name of the Peach State, served in a different war almost a century and a half ago. Yet these two ships have more in common than first meets the eye. Fire! The Confederate Navy strategy was to hit him at as further distance as possible. Just the strike capability alone of the SSGN submarine is just it's unparalleled. The basics haven't changed a whole lot. It's, it's how you employ them with the technology that you have. But uh, your life is still very much as dependent on the guy next to you as it was 150 years ago. And surprisingly to some, both ships exist only because of the hard work of the women of Georgia. In my long dress and boots, I'd have been right there with them raising money. I think it's a wonderful thing. The fascinating story of two remarkable ships, A Tale of Two Georgias, brought to you by the Coastal Heritage Society. Thank you.